Hey everybody, it's Simmerstock and welcome back to another video. So in this video, we're going to be doing our University Let's Play Part 4. And um, today I was thinking, since we just got back from the gym, I haven't really played since then. So I just took her home and made her pee and really get ready because we're about to go on our first actual date with Paxton. So we're going to go ahead and change our outfit. It's a casual date, so it's going to be a casual outfit. Right now she won't have shoes on because she because I have shoes not allowed indoors for right now. I'm going to take you guys to the lot that I actually built. And it's actually pretty fun, so I can't wait to show you guys. We are here at the lot with Paxton, but I am going to go ahead and talk to him first before I go ahead and show you guys the lot park so it's called the fun fair right now it's like sand sequoia fun fair because that's where i based it but it has a little water park it has a toddler little park it has a little cafe right here with the bubble tea and everything then we got a few rides and then we also got this fountain from the new romantic well it's not new it's newly free <laughs> if you haven't gotten it already make sure to get it because it is free right now it comes with this little fountain and this little wishing well which you can go ahead and make a wish which we're gonna actually do today we'll go ahead and explore that today as well but i'm gonna go ahead and we're gonna go view this together we're getting in the fountain together to play around i think that's so cute <laughs> Although, I'd probably never do it myself because, um, girl, you got your whole shoes on in the water. Like, what are you doing? <laughs> Those soggy-ass Uggs. Anyways, same with you. Why do you got your boots on? But, anyways, I love this little fountain. You could toss a coin. You can, um, splash around, of course. You could sit. I think it's super cute. There we go. Now the water park actually looks like a water park. But then we're going to go ahead and ride the Ferris wheel. And maybe, just maybe, we will woohoo today. It depends on how she's feeling. You know, if she decides that she wants to feel a little flirty, then maybe we will. Damn, she really wants to ride that Ferris wheel. Like, why are you running? <laughs> why are you running? Why are you running? <laughs> why are you running? You, did, you just completely left him. Like... What about him? I accidentally clicked ride the Ferris wheel without him, so now she's going to go ask him if he wants to ride it. He made a, a little meal here, so maybe we'll get our little grub on later. Our man cooking for us and everything. He is also high as a kite. I can see it in those red eyes. <laughs> but look at our man cooking us a whole meal and everything. We're going to go ahead and ride the Ferris wheel together. And then maybe we'll give him a little kiss, flirt with him a little bit, take a little photo with him maybe. Of course, this is a little rabbit hole, so we're just going to look at the Ferris wheel and pretend that we see them in it. <laughs> Even though it is a rabbit hole, I'm still glad it's a thing in the sentence, you know what I mean? The sun is setting, it's 9pm, so we're going to try to wrap up this date, sadly. Um, I wish I actually went here earlier with him, but we did not. So we're going to give him a little kiss, flirt with him a little bit before we maybe ask him to be our boyfriend because I feel like this would be like the perfect time to talk about a treasured memory. We'll compliment his appearance. And we don't have enough time to ask him if he wants to be our boyfriend. So we're actually just going to ask him if he wants to spend the night maybe. So let's go ahead and take him back to the house. Oh, wait, first, let's get a picture because we need their first couple picture, even though they're not a couple yet. Maybe we should wait until they are a couple. So we'll come back here when they are a couple and then we'll ride the romantic ride. We'll get a little romantic picture together. It'll be all cute and everything. Also, we, we'll go ahead and use that um, wishing fountain or whatever so we can get a feel of how that works and everything maybe we can actually win some simoleons because she's not doing well financially i'm not gonna lie and it's not like we can work because we got school 800 simoleons so it's not looking well for us um we're gonna go ahead and ask him if he wants to spend the night we're flirting with him a little bit and now we got the option to invite him to stay the night so that's what we're gonna do and then obviously we're gonna head to bed and oh or actually, they're, he's feeling kind of flirty. Maybe we could actually get it on. A sleepover? Sounds great. Mm -hmm. Let's go ahead and try to woohoo with Paxton. Oh, 
Ooh, I think it's, yes, they're getting it on. Yay. <laughs> so they're going to get their first woohoo on. It says, break out the candles, make it romantic. Marcy is about to have her woohoo for the first time. Girl's losing her virginity right here. So I'm so happy for her. It says, I'm having a bit of a personal emergency and I have to leave now. What personal emergency? Do you got a secret side hoe we don't know about? Oh well, anyways, I was about to say it's semi-morning, so I'm gonna get her up and get her ready. She's gonna go use the bathroom. Take a shower, and that whole take a pregnancy thing is kind of scaring me, but also not because they did use a condom. But as we know, condoms are not always effective. But I do have pregnancy set to a 15 or 20% chance. So even if the condom didn't work, then we still got those chances of her not being pregnant. So we're going to go ahead and brush her teeth. And then we're going to apply this um, face mask. She's eating some leftovers for breakfast. So after she's done eating, since she does not have class today, um, I'm thinking we could actually finish that date with, um, Axton later, hopefully, but as of right now, I'm thinking she should care for herself, maybe do a little workout or something. I was also thinking maybe she should get a dog or, like, a cat or something, because I love animals personally. And I also feel like Marcy, since she has the house and the time, she could walk the dog in the morning or... I don't know. If she got a cat, she could just love on it and cuddle with it. I don't know. I have a term paper to study for. I mean, a final exam to study for and a term paper to write. So, we're going to have to be able to repair this laptop, which we cannot afford whatsoever. So, actually, you know what? Maybe we will go on a date early with Paxton because we can go to that wishing well and maybe wish for some money because <laughs> that's what we need. We are here with everybody, so we're going to go say hi to Paxton. He already has to pee, so I hope he doesn't leave us. We're going to give him a little kiss, and then we're going to maybe ask him to be our boyfriend. And I know I keep saying that, but it's like, I don't want to ask him too soon, and then he ends up cheating on us or something. Or, you know, I don't want to wait too late, and then he ends up dating somebody else. I don't know. A little vibe check with our boyfriend, or, oh. See, I'm already calling him our boyfriend, so we might as well just make her ask her him out. That's what we're gonna do. There's no reason to wait, so let's just do it. See what he says. And of course, he said yes, so I'm so excited for them. They're a couple now. They're gonna go take a little picture to celebrate, and then maybe woohoo. We're gonna go take a romantic photo. And then we'll take a photo with Ava, too. Go take a... Let's go take a friendly photo with uh, Ava right now. Just so we can get a picture with our bestie. We're going to Woohoo on the ride and see what he does. <laughs> or see what he says, really. Hopefully he says yes, but of course he does. So, And then, of course, we're going to come to the wishing fountain right here. And we're going to make a wish for some simoleons. I almost did the child one, which is not what we want at all. And as you can see, the ride, the woohoo is going on in the ride, so yay for them. Hopefully they use their protection. They just got done woohooing, and now she's gonna go make a wish at that fountain. And then maybe we'll order some food, because I think she's getting hungry. She's making a wish. <gasps> Let's see what happens. Uh, please, pl please, please, please. Is it mad at me? What's happening? Having wish granted? Is my wish being granted? It says she earned money, but like, no the fuck she didn't. Okay, so we can't make another wish. We lost money. This is great. Might as well buy a thrift outfit, why don't we? <laughs> no, but really, I think we're just gonna go ahead and head home. It's been a little bit since we've been here, and we got a few pictures to put on the wall and decorate the house, so... We'll do that. We'll come back to this park another day and make a wish because I am not done, okay? I am not done whatsoever. Actually, what if we went out to eat with all of our friends? I think that'd be cool. 
Okay, we are here at the restaurant, and I took him the pot pies, which is actually in the university town. And no, this is not here naturally. I um I built it and placed it here. And this is what it looks like. I think it's super cute. It goes on a 20 by 15 lot. And we're going to go ahead and request a table for us and our friends. We are all here together ordering our food. I'm going to go ahead and order for everybody. It's on me, even though we're the broke ones here. Um, That makes total sense. We're going to get some lemonades for the girlies and orange juices for the boys. I don't know why, just what I felt. We're going to get some popcorn shrimp for uh, Ava here because that sounds actually really good. Um, maybe this fried fish plate for Paxton. I feel like he would want that. Some chicken nuggets for Bryce because why not? And you know what? For our girly, we're also going to get some popcorn shrimp because that sounds good. And it, the bill comes out to 45 which is not bad at all. We finally got our meal here. And how did his chicken nuggets come out poor? I feel bad. They look like grungy as hell. <laughs> Why do they look dirty? I don't understand that. I hope our popcorn shrimp is good. I hope we don't get food poisoning. <laughs> oh, she learned the how to make popcorn shrimp yay i'm gonna take a break from the university bar for tonight and we're actually gonna head to the willow creek bar which is in our town and it's one that i built and it has a rooftop bar and everything so it's gonna be super fun paxton's leaving as just as we're pouring drinks for everybody like freak you dude you're always leaving at the worst times might as well double cup it, triple cup it. I don't care. This girl's getting drunk tonight. It is Saturday. She is gonna get her drink on. So that's what we're doing. But Paxton's our boyfriend now. So we really should uh, maybe dial down on talking to our ex and everything. I know her ex has been hitting her up with some weird, weird comments lately. So we just gotta keep an eye out for him. Keep our distance and make sure she doesn't flirt with anybody else because i want her to be a loyal girlfriend <laughs> has the option to take a pregnancy test so i'm wondering you know is it still a possibility because she really has to pee and it's really going down fast so we're gonna go ahead take a pregnancy test and see what happens because i'm kind of scared <laughs> she just drank two drinks so Hopefully she's not pregnant. Hopefully Marcy is not pregnant. Thank God. <laughs> I was getting a little worried there. <laughs> but she is drunk and getting tired. So I'm going to go ahead and take her back to her house where she can actually relax and everything. So that's what we're going to do real quick. Back at her house, it is 6 p.m. and she's like exhausted. So I'm going to have her go to bed. Miss Girl is also very drunk. So yeah, I think it's probably best that she just heads to bed. Like look at the way she's walking. Marcy, it's me, Paxton. Do you want to go to the, huh? Do you want to go on a date to the American Retro Diner? You see, Paxton, I just invited you somewhere. You decided not to show up, but the thing is, we're exhausted. We're drunk. We're staying home. <laughs> it's Sunday morning. Our girl Ma Marcy, I almost called her Macy, is hungover, and she needs to shave. So we're gonna have her shave. Today we just need to focus on doing our homework, focusing on her studies and everything. I also forgot to put up these pictures that we took yesterday. And I know these turn out very small, so I am going to size them up. The waffle maker did not burn down our house. And we're going to get our lovely little pumpkin spice waffles. How good they look, you guys. Uh, that does not look like pumpkin spice. I told you to make pumpkin spice waffles. What are you doing making these? She don't listen to me, you guys, but let's go look at these photos. This is the picture that we took with Paxton, which is super cute. And look at the picture with Ava. It's also super cute. And also, I forgot to show you guys this photo, which I, um, which I took the other days, uh, with the pose pack that I downloaded. So... Yeah, super cute. I'm glad to get these photos and memories in her in her collection, I guess. So we're going to go ahead, grab a serving of these waffles, and then work on our homework. 
Ava is at our front door as we're finishing up our homework, so we might invite her in and maybe have a drink with her, like some adult drinks, like some wine or something, not no beer. And Ava can enjoy herself while I finish this homework because just because she's here does not mean we have to stop with our schoolwork, you feel? Um, I think this is where we're going to stop today's episode. And if you guys enjoyed it, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more content. And turn on push notifications so you know when I post. And let me know what you guys want to see in the next episode. Which, you know, maybe we should take her on vacation or something. I don't know. Either way, she's really going to have to focus on her studies. Because that's something that we really haven't been doing, I feel. And I say that because it's really the most more boring part. It's just her just sitting there studying and everything. And I feel like that's just not what you guys want to see. What, not what you guys want to see stop for today and yeah I'll see you guys in the next episode